you sleep? <laughs> if Officer Battles kills my daddy, will he become my new daddy? That's the cold of the West. I saw that in a movie. If you see another woman husband, you have to take her, care of her and her young ones. That's the cold of the West, huh? I think it's time to try to get a little sleep. Sometimes I see myself sleep. Do you want to sing? Mm, sure. Sure, what's a good one that you sing? You pick it. Okay. Three animals and three blind mice Sitting on the curbstone shooting dice The horse rolled off and fell on the flea Whoops, said the flea, there's a horsey on me. Boom, boom, ain't it great to be crazy? Boom, boom, ain't it great to be nuts like us? Giddy and foolish all day long. Boom, boom, ain't it great to be crazy? Nick, I just got confirmation that their witness is definitely Connie. Sorry. Why? Why are you sorry? There's nothing to be sorry about. All right, Carmine? You know where they're keeping the kid. Yeah. I swear I really believe she was taking little Billy to visit her sister. Just so long she's not taking him to Joliet to visit me. What are you doing? If I wanted it there, I would have left it there. I don't want pictures of dead people around me. She would do this to me, Carmine. That she would talk to my kid. That's why she's gonna die. Not for what she says to my judge. For what she says to my kid. I understand, Nicky. Please, Nick, I'm your attorney. I don't want to hear you talk like this. Oh, you don't want to hear me talk like this? I don't want to hear what she's gonna say either. But it seems to be my tough coconut, doesn't it? Doesn't it? Tell me she's dead, Carmine. That's all I want to hear, that she's dead. And I'll sleep like I'm in my mother's stomach. Otherwise, I'm going to have to take a trip to Tibet for the winter. It's all set up, Nikki. We got our people in place. It's just a matter of time. Oh, it's just a matter of time. Is that all it is? Tomorrow she torpedoes me. I want to know when. Am I talking Gualamanian? When, Carmine, when? I just want to know when. Cooking, you see me? You shouldn't use salt. There you go. How is that? Great. Just the way I like them. You gonna scowl at me all day? You gonna ogle her all day? I wasn't ogling. You were ogling. I never ogle. I know when I ogle when I see you. I, I don't ogle. I was appreciating. She's not a horrendous looking woman, okay? She's got the kind of legs I like. Yeah, what kind's that? We're trying with feet on one end and hips on the other, right? Yeah. She's a good-looking woman. That's a fact, so I noticed. Hey, okay, are you done? Are you done? Yeah. Jeez, the way you two bicker, you sound like an old married couple. You see that? Now we're known as bickerers. Wait till that gets around the department. What is it? Something must be wrong. I didn't see any SWAT teams or news crews outside. You guys didn't bust any more bad guys while picking up your coffee and donuts this morning? Yeah, we did. But we didn't have time to book them and do the paperwork. You're in the bathroom. Be careful where you sit. Hey, um, if you get a chance, maybe you could uh, look for that photograph. You know the one at Disneyland? Oh, yeah. Uh, I don't think I got it. But, uh... 
I don't think I got it. How about a lift? Sorry, got no wheels. I do. Me giving a lift to Charlie Battles. Does life have no limits? Yeah. This is one of them. I'm not riding shotgun. I'm no hunk of iron. Come on, CB. You don't mind I call you that, do you? I know the guys call you that, and I just love that male bonding sort of thing. And anyway, you're not afraid to ride a bike, are you? I mean, you don't look afraid to anything like you're gonna drive, which you're not gonna do. So why are you sitting in my place? No way, Jose. Look, kid, I started on one of these when you were riding tricycles. If you rode a bike back when you started, it wasn't on one of these. Probably there was something with half the gut, maybe. Look, I can still give you a lift. I... My bike. Right Who's the right shot? You gonna cheat? Cause if you're gonna cheat, I'm taking my bike and going home. Apache Brave Firewalk to see who drives back. I'll just meet you there. Be on my way. Why? Where you staying? This is real swell of you, CB. No, it's not swell. You just use that phone over there and get yourself a motel, Prado. Uh, no problem. I'm as good as out of here. You know, it's just when I got that phone call to come down here, I threw some stuff in the bag and started barreling down the old hyphenated line. Got to the safe house, you and I pulled guns, and voila. Looks like a nice neighborhood to live in. This a nice neighborhood? I like neighborhoods. You know, the old-fashioned kind that the zoners are trying to take away from us? Well, you're in luck. This one says always a vacancy. Nice place. Kind of YMCA meets no tell motel. Glad you approve. Oh, here we go. Cable adult movies and waterbeds. Sounds like the ticket. You got it all here, huh? <laughs> Ninety-five a day. That sounds good to you. Sounds good to me. Here, I'll dial it. Uh, Hill. What you got over here? The best of Steve and Edie. <laughs> Ron DMC. <laughs> the lounge lizards. Who would have thought to this old old what? Was not was. G seven. Fighting the dinosaur. Give me my money back. That's not one. Not one? Who, what, who? Those are my daughter Cindy. Her records. I put mine back in after she left. Miss Cindy? Yes, sir. Silver wings upon their chest. Is our men. This you and Connie? The Mad Hatter's magical kingdom? One hundred men. Whoa, oh, rock my socks. Who's the good looking geek in the crew cut, you? Yeah, that's right. Good looking. What are you, a homo? Uh, don't worry. I'll sleep on the couch. Sleep? What do you mean, sleep? You know what's bothering me? Yeah. I know everything that bothers you. You tell me everything. You never shut up. Don't you want to know what I think about this case? No. Those two guys we busted? Uh, you spotted me from the window in the apartment, right? 
looking down from the window when I was watching those two punks in the Chinese restaurant? Brutal me this, Batman. If you're in the apartment and you have a perfect view of the Chinese restaurant, when you're in the Chinese restaurant, what do you have a perfect view of? I really scoped out that neighborhood. If I was gonna move on Connie, that's where I would do it from. We were Villanova's hitman. Villanova knows where Connie is. Go on up to the folks in the newspaper. You want anything? You know, cigarettes are bad for your chest. Yeah? Why don't you let me worry about my chest? And think about me and the kid. Nothing unless you hear from your battles. You got that? Yeah. <sighs> 